Hello everyone. How are you? It is Lakidra. I pray that you all are uplifted in your faith. I wanted to come on and bring a word of encouragement to you all. And I wanted to pray with that one that may be hurting right now. For the Lord's word shall be your strength. I declare and decree all bondage, all fear, all weariness. I bind it and declare and decree that it is leaving your mind now. I declare and decree only peace and joy. Only peace and joy and strength. Oh, the glory of the Lord is covering your heart and your mind. Your life will never be the same. Yes, Lord, we thank you that you have sent forth your word and you have healed us. You have healed us, oh God, and you have delivered us from out of all of destruction. Lord, thank you for your peace that passes all understanding. Lord, for that one right now that needs strength, Lord God, let your word become spirit. Let your word be grace. Let your word, oh God, touch that heart. And guard it and protect it from every lie. Oh God, bring forth hope and joy, unspeakable joy for the joy of the Lord. Oh, thank you. Is that one strength right now? I thank you, Lord God. Your Holy Spirit is moving, is moving over that dark situation, over that emptiness, over that bondage. Oh God, and it is sending it out. It is removing it. It is separating it. Hallelujah. It is separating it from their mind, removing it from their thoughts. Lord, thank you that there is now only healing. There is now only strength. There is now, Lord God, only power. Power to rise up. Power, Lord God, to, to get back. Get back to that place. Lord God, to get back to where you have them and dust themselves off and get back in the race. Lord, thank you that they are not alone. Your people are not alone. Lord, thank you, Jesus, for the enemy has been bound. He has been cast out. Thank you for the victory. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Oh, your word would not return back void. Oh, yes, husbands and wives. Oh, God, they shall be an illustration of the way Christ and the church are one. Lord, thank you that hostility and enmity had to go because your word has removed it. Your word, oh, God, has put it to death. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you for putting your words in our mouths. You're planting things in our lives. Lord, you're bringing life. You're bringing restoration. You're bringing healing. For your word is spirit and life. Thank you, Jesus. Darkness had to flee. Oh, praise your name. Deliverance had to come. Hallelujah, because your word brings deliverance. Your word brings power. Your word removes all fear. Lord, thank you. Your word is surrounding your people right now. Your word is protecting their minds right now. Oh, God, as the scriptures say, a man shall leave father and mother and cleave unto his wife. And the two are united into one flesh. Thank you, Lord God, for the miracles that are coming forth in marriages because your word is going forth. Lord, to the hearers right now, to the listeners right now that are hearing this word, thank you that your word is becoming life to them. Thank you, Lord God, your word is bringing forth miracles in that dead marriage. It is bringing it back to life. The same word you spoke in the beginning, Lord God, and light came. Lord, thank you, Jesus, for the word that is going forth. It is bringing life. It is opening up blinded eyes, oh God. Oh God, in spouses who were away from you. Lord, thank you, your word is ordering their footsteps. It's bringing them back home. It's bringing them back in the kingdom of God. Thank you, Lord God. Your word right now is bringing forth conviction. Lord, thank you, Jesus. Your word is softening hearts. Lord God, as we stand in the gap for our spouses right now, our children, Lord, thank you. Your word is renewing their strength. Your word is exposing the lies. Your word is delivering them from evil. Oh God, your word is bringing salvation. Your word is, is bringing, Lord God, righteousness. The things that they were once caught up in. Your word has just turned them away from it. Hallelujah. Your word is now guiding them. Thank you, Jesus. Your word is raising them up. Praise your name. 
And now families are being healed. Oh, thank you, Jesus. We're sending forth your word. Your word will not return back void. It will prosper where unto the things it is being sent. We give you the praise right now. Thank you, Lord God, for saving, saving marriages, bringing salvation. Thank you for bringing deliverance. Oh, we bless your holy name. Hallelujah, Lord. Oh, God, we thank you. Weeping only endures for a night, but joy comes in the morning. And they that sow in tears shall reap joy and shall come back, oh, God, with the harvest in their hands. The harvest of restoration and marriages. The harvest of salvation and the harvest of eyes opening up. Hallelujah. The harvest of joy. The harvest of, of deliverance. Praise your name. The harvest, oh God, of increase in every area of our lives. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. For this oneness. Thank you, God, for the divine connections. Praise your name between a husband and his wife. Oh, God, thank you that mental, mental, oh, God, mental bondage is being broken. Thank you, God, sexual immorality is being broken. Now there is coming, Lord God, purity. There is coming, Lord God, your glory. There is coming, Lord God, love and kindness, joy and patience and meekness. Oh, God, thank you, Jesus. Unity between a husband and his wife. Lord, thank you that marriages. They are illustrating the way Christ and the church are one. Thank you for our harvest, oh God. Thank you for suddenness. We give you the praise in Jesus' holy name. Trust him, people of God, for he love you. Continue giving him praise. Continue, hallelujah, calling forth those things that be not because they are. They are. It doesn't matter what it looks like. Speak those things because they are true. They are the word of God. The Lord is saying, send forth that word. That's what's going to be your harvest. Remember, God loves you and I love you too. And until next time, bye-bye.